What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be taking out our brand new St. Croix rod, which I'm going to be showing you. It's absolutely gorgeous guys. Got it equipped with a brand new reel. I'm going to be showing you all those details in just a moment. First, me Chrissy Pooh here. Hello Chrissy Pooh. Can't even tell we got to catch some bait. So we're gonna try to catch some ladyfish. We're at a high tide. We got our first little cool snap really of the season. So we're gonna try to get some, uh, catch some sharks on this new St. Croix. And it's a light, light tackle, guys. So stay tuned, let's catch some uh, fish. See if we can get on some uh, ladyfish, which we know we can. We just gotta get them in the boat. <clears throat> One more for good luck. Just took him a minute to show up. Oh my god. Oh, he's off. Let me use that rod. Oh, come back. Oh, you're lucky. You're lucky. Oh, this is the perfect lot bait. Look at this. Oh no. Alright guys. Perfect COVID bait. Alright, we're done. Let's go fish. So as I promised, here is my St. Croix Mojo Inshore. This is the brand new Inshore they just released, guys. Check out this awesome grip on the rod. Got this beautiful color, not quite as strong as the Avid. It's like a more of a green, uh, you know, a darker green color. Real nice, got the cork. I paired this with the Concept A3. It's got a lot of drag. We're gonna flex this thing today, put out either a live ladyfish or a cut ladyfish and see if we can't put this rod to the test even test the reel a little bit but very very impressed with all the great uh, features on here it's got the same IPC qualities this is a 7.6 uh, heavy power fast action so it tips really really fast but the backbone is really really stiff it's going to give a lot of power for those larger fish who knows we might get a cobia we might get a shark the odds are in our favor today so let's go all right, check out this guy's new toadfish board. If you're interested in one of these, check the link in the description. Even got my toadfish knife folded right up out of the tackle box. Very easy. Now, guys, if, if you're a little squirmish, you may want to turn away from this one. Viewer discretion is advised. We're gonna hook her up. Got a nice light wire leader. This is something I've already pre-rigged. Got a circle hook on here so that way we can get the shark unhooked fairly quickly. There's nothing crazy guys, because I mean, we're out here, these sharks aren't the biggest sharks, but we also have some cobes. And if you use a light wire, there's a, the odds are good that you could get a, uh, a cobe. Just gonna tie the improved clinch knot. If you're not familiar, I'll leave the link down in the description for my knot playlist. Check this out. Very fundamental knot. The one you definitely want to know. I'm just gonna leave a little bit of a tag on there, nothing crazy. Alright, let's just go ahead, put this big old chunk on here. Just like that. We're gonna toss it out in the deeper part of the water here. Hey Josh, you should tell us about your uh, unit you're using to scan these uh, fish with. So in order to find the fish, you need the Invisibird, 
and I've already plugged in my coordinates. All the fish they're saying are right here, so we're gonna about to we're about to get them. Hey, if you guys want an Invisibird, we've just developed it. Thing is seamless with your console. <laughs> First cast with a new Saint Croix, and that felt good. All right, she's in the hole. She's got fresh bait. Do we have anyone home that's hungry? That's the question. Let's go. We're going to sit her in the rod holder, and we'll know in a second. Going? Hold up, hold up. It's a circle hook. Go, 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 go. Get him out. All right, Chris is on. We're over here, we changed it up, trying to snook fish a little bit. I think he's got a nice snook. No, you're on, man. All right, oh, careful. Oh, this is a healthy fish, Chris. It's a good fish. Careful for them rocks. He can still cut you off. Uh, you heard that pop? Ooh, I feel like it's a big ass catfish. Could be, it ain't a catfish. It's either a big jack or a snook. No, 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 no. Oh, he's he's all in them rocks. Chris is about to lose him. <laughs> Chris is about to lose him. Chris is doubting my tactics over here, guys. Say the big jack or a big snook? Which one is it? It's definitely no kitty. Big jack. Hey, putting the St. Croix to use. Not the one we were, we wanted to catch it on. Really good, no doubt about it. Every bit of what he looked like in the water. Hold on to that tail. Woo! <laughs> That's a big, big old jack. Nice fish, bro. Salty skills. Oh. Dude, you can see all the rapid stuff. It's perfect. Man, that water is fucking freezing. Oh, that's the one I thought it was. All right, guys. Cut me a new bait. They like them some fresh ladyfish. A little off the mark, but we'll let us. Yep. We're falling down. And they see what we're doing. They're like, oh no. All right, guys, same setup. We just caught that jack on. We're going to go ahead and throw a live ladyfish out there. Went ahead and hooked him through the roof of the mouth. Let's get a big in. Think I should go over there, you said? Or go towards that mouth? Well, either way, he's going to come back, so. I really like a little weight when I'm using an elbow. Finds him, he's gone. Even a cove, man. I guarantee you, coves swim up in here. This just looks like a healthy spot. He's getting, he's getting destroyed, Josh. He's getting Hold destroyed. Up. Let me get it on film. Turn the camera. I told you. Guys, this lady going. fish is going nuts. Oh, no. Double hook up, guys. Where are we at? Where are we at? Where are we at? Double hook up. Over you. Oh, oh, he broke you? Oh, Chris just got destroyed. He just had it in his mouth, but he had it. Josh just looked up, guys. Guys, on the new St. Croix, Chris lost it. Was yours a snook or a jack? He didn't have it all the way, though. He was just smoking with it. Dude, you were getting destroyed over there. Rehook hill. Rehook him, keep him in the water. All right, guys, the new St. Croix, it's a jack. So it's a school of jacks. 
Yeah, you gotta show that to the camera. Check this out guys, ladyfish just got destroyed. Let's help Josh get his, then we'll get the, another one The new out. outfit. What you got, what you got? Here's got another it. big one, he ain't as big I don't think. Jack and tag. Watch this ball over here. I don't know, maybe he is. How's that outfit feel, Josh? Dude, this outfit is butter Sweet. smooth. You saw how much quicker I got him in with this stouter rod? Oh, yeah. That's the difference between a heavier rod, guys. You want to grab his? That could be your thumbnail right there, yeah. <laughs> So you got to see the rod in action, guys. Let me go over a few of the other features that I probably missed earlier. Again, guys, this is the brand new Mojo Inshore 7.6. It's a heavy rod. As you can see, I whipped that jack uh, quickly, uh, comparable to Chris. He fought it for a good while. The reel helped a little bit because it has extra torque. But some of the things that are really impressive about the new Inshore is this EVA cork and this extra grip, black grip that they added to the rod. It's got a nice contour for the casting rods, really fits nicely when you're holding the reel. Uh, I found that my grip was really comfortable there. It's got the oversized Keegan uh, hook keeper for your big jigs and lures and hooks. So that was nice, uh, it doesn't get caught up. A lot of them I notice never have enough space there and it just scratches the rod and just gets caught up uh, over time. But same beautiful graphite, guys. Has a five-year St. Croix warranty. I would highly recommend you check them out. I'll leave the link down in the description if you want to maybe pick up your husband, daughter, wife, boyfriend, a new rod and reel for Christmas. This would be an excellent decision or choice. So make sure you hit that thumbs up, comment below, and subscribe if you haven't already. Hey, you want to see a, a brand new St. Croix Mojo rod break? No. If you do, let me know. If you haven't watched the last one, Hit that right up there. Tick, tick. Till next time, I'll see you on the water.